Oh, um, my connection was actually, we were here last year, I believe, you and Krakow, at this very club. And, um, and I met Iggy and uh, his parents, and uh, they approached me right away. They said, uh, actually, he was opening. And uh, there was a buzz in the room about this kid, and I heard about him, you know, briefly. And uh, so we got here just before uh, we got on, and we got to hear him play. There was a few problems with the band, I remember, but... Um, you could tell right away that he was shining, um, he was playing, he's got some chops, he's got some talent. And for a minute, I thought he was a girl, he's a beautiful boy, you know, beautiful face. It's just like he was kicking, I'm going, wow. So I met his parents backstage and uh, they introduced themselves and he said, yeah, that's our son. I'm going, oh, wow, cool, man. And uh, he is 14 years old and, um, and I, the first thing out of my mouth was, He's got some talent, man. This this kid can go places, you know. He needs a little uh, focus and a little uh, channeling and support around him. So anyway, that was my connection to Iggy, Igor, and his parents, and uh, and I also fell in love with the fact that his mom and dad were there, and you know, he's a kid with talent, and they're kind of guiding his uh, career somewhat, trying to build it. And they asked me right away, "Would you be interested in me and Boston? Please, you know, I'm." I'm always into doing stuff like that, you know. So, long story short, it took a minute, but they fin we finally connected. And about a month ago, I had a week off in LA because I've been real busy. And we got, I heard the tracks, fell in love with the tracks, uh, and we did the album. So, um, there you go. to be this way and I must realize that love is Well, gone. right away, I heard at least three or four AOR hits, meaning big guitars, big hooks, great melody lines, and uh, and the vocalist. Um, there was some rough, there was some scratch vocals, there was catching the, the arrangements because this is going to be the only opportunity for me to track. So I said, whatever you have, make sure you just have the arrangement so I can give you some nice tracks, or two passes or whatever. And uh, I think it's got great potential. It's just, um, it's, um, it's songs with a lot of attitude, great guitar playing, obviously, um, and um, hooks, you know what I'm saying? Great melody lines, so melodic rock at its best with some of the shredding. Uh, so it's the kind of album I would do personally. So um, yeah, I think it's gonna do some things. It's enough for this kid because uh, they're doing the right thing, and he's got the goods, you know. Well, you know, it's been bits and pieces, and I've been getting information through management, Siren Management, Ace Trump, who uh, manages me. And uh, he also manages Sid Lissy and Black Star Writers. So I've been getting info from him, but I remember uh, Vinny calling me and said, Marco, you know, are you playing on this thing? What you, what's going on? I said, bro, get involved. It's really a good thing, you know. And so I heard some of the drum tracks. I, I can't say that I heard all of the tracks because it's a work in progress. 